back here at home now, 820 and turning to the forecast, meteorologist Matt Peterson is showing us just how hot it's going to get in the coming days. Yeah, just it's a not break. right now. Yeah, it's a break <laughs> from that heat and humidity, Jan. It's a brief break, but we'll definitely take it, especially after what we had yesterday. Temperatures that were in the 90s, high humidity, making it feel almost like the triple digits. And then we had strong thunderstorms come through as well. But today is practically perfect out there. We'll have nice bright sunshine. Highs are going to drop back down into the 80s for the first time in a couple of afternoons. Humidity is lower. The breeze could be a little bit strong from time to time, but overall, again, a pretty nice day for us and it's a nice welcome change like I said from the last couple of afternoons now this week coming up it's a shortened work week for a lot of folks 4th of July holiday coming on Thursday so what we're experiencing through the holiday week is comfortable early on especially on our Monday, but the heat and humidity, they quickly return. We're looking for another heat wave to potentially take over as we get into the middle of the week. And we're also watching a couple of shower and thunderstorm chances as we head into the fourth. So it's a bit of a roller coaster ride for us for this, uh, as I said, shortened work week for lots of folks. Storm scan three quiet currently the cold front that was the main catalyst for all the shower and thunderstorm that we had yesterday. Well off the coast at this point, maybe a few high clouds out there for us. You see some around Williamsport and even here around the Delaware Valley too. But with shower and thunderstorm activity in upstate New York, again, a weak boundary could start to work its way through later this afternoon, and that could give us maybe a stray shower here or there. Future weather, not too much happening currently, but as we jump ahead into the early afternoon hours, you see by 1 o'clock, there are those isolated light showers starting to develop in the Lehigh Valley. Not anything that's overly concerning. No severe weather at all with this. This would just be a passing light shower. No even flash flooding threat or anything like that. As we get towards the 3, 4, 5 o'clock time frame, some of those showers could push through Philly and South Jersey. The good news for us as we head into the evening and then overnight tonight, definitely looking relatively clear and comfortable. 87 for the temperature today. We're staying in the 80s, Jan, tomorrow. But here comes heat wave number two. Starts on Tuesday, and it could last all the way through the holiday and maybe even into the this coming weekend. So enjoy this break while we have it. Indeed. Thank you so much.